Hey, what's going on everyone? Welcome to the Nine Miles As Seen on TV Gadget Review, Ch Review Channel. Today, I'm gonna do another grocery outlet review. This is a product that I found at Grocery Outlet. Checked it uh, on Amazon, it gets four out of five stars. On Amazon, this is six bucks at Grocery Outlet. This was uh, $1.98, something like that. So. My goal this month is 5,000 stars. I'm 71% of the way there, so I really appreciate those that gave the stars. Uh, but yeah, on the review, so I'm, I did a, something they do in Asking on TV infomercials. I, hey, Aaron, how's it going? Um, I already cooked the pasta, so it's ready to go. It's ready to test out. And so just let me show you the uh, ingredients here. It's cauliflower, but it's made up of multiple ingredients here. So we just have lentil flour, pea flour, cauliflower fl flour. It's made in an allergen-free facility, Veggie Craft Farms, and I think two bucks for a box of, uh, you know, kind of alternative pasta is a pretty good deal, especially if you, uh, you know, you don't want the. I guess, I guess this is gluten-free. This is uh, non-GMO, vegan, certified gluten-free, and whatever that means. And then it's. Oh, it's a product of Italy. Wow. So it has a lot of interesting things going for it. A lot of kind of features, but I'm going to strain the pasta here. So let's bring the camera over to the sink here. And I got the, it's already boiled. It took, the directions was eight to nine minutes boiling. So I'm just going to drain so you can check it out, drain the pasta. And that's what it looks like, the linguine. So that's the only kind that I saw that they had the linguine. That's why I got that. All right. So. Here we go. Cauliflower pasta. I'm just gonna set some aside. Gonna have a little bit, I know people are gonna be really upset about this, but I should have got spaghetti or some sort of Alfredo sauce, but this is what I had in my fridge. So on one half, I'm gonna put a little pasta sauce. And then give it a taste test and tell you what I think. So here we go. Let's do a live in-person review here. All right. So this was from Grocery Outlet on online. It was like six, seven bucks. Uh, but at Grocery Outlet, it was a two bucks, which is great. And let's try it out. So this is the linguine cauliflower pasta. Here we go. This is the first time trying it. I've never had it. Texture wise, it's close to pasta. It's a little bit less chewy. Pasta kind of has an al dente, uh, that little chewiness that I like. This tastes a little, I mean, I didn't overcook it. So it tastes just a tad mushier, I'd say. But taste wise, um, it's hard to describe. It's a little like, I almost want to say muddier or just, I mean, that's a bad word. It's not like, it's just, it tastes a little bit different than, than pasta. It's not, you can tell there's extra ingredients going on in here. Maybe like the difference between like, uh, you know, like, uh, a wheat bread and like a heavy multi-grain bread. You can tell like there's just a little something extra. You can just tell there's more ingredients going on. All right, let's taste with a little bit of pasta sauce here. A 
It's not bad though. I mean, if you're looking for an alternative to regular pasta, like regular, they have spaghetti, they have linguine. This is a great choice. I mean, I would, I would definitely get it again. Uh, so once again, I'm doing some reviews from the grocery outlet. I haven't been there in like, I don't know, seven years or something. It's been a long time, but I came back. I'm pre pleasantly sur surprised. I would say comparing like the dollar store and uh, big lots to grocery outlet, in my opinion, just in, in the result, you know, initial results today, and it probably depends on which store you go to. It would be like comparing like motel six to the four seasons or, Kroger to uh, Whole Foods or something like that. It's just it's just a step above, and the the deals are actually good deals. They're not just like like Big Lots. I've noticed a lot of it's just kind of it's the same price as any other store, if not more expensive. But uh, grocery outlet, you can get some quality food for a great price. So uh, yeah, so let me just show you this once again. All right, so we have seventeen viewers. 18 viewers. This is kind of a trial. I don't think people don't really know what grocery outlet is, so it's understandable. But uh, yeah, once again, I do recommend it. It's a good, good, good product. And yeah, this is probably my last grocery outlet review, but wanted to bring it to everybody's attention and kind of a cool, if it's in your area, I would go check it out because they have some great deals. And I'm going to definitely become a regular shopper. So thanks for watching everyone. Until next time, I'll see you later. Thanks for watching my review. See you later.